Well, not many people can say they've lived a full life by 22, but for one USF student from Ukraine, between the pandemic and the war in his homeland, saying he's faced a lot of challenges might be an understatement. News Channel 8's Trevor Sohaki has his story. In the mass of names read at the Yingling Center, one stood out from the rest, Danilo Solomensev. It's Ukrainian, and if that doesn't tell you enough, it's been quite the journey getting to this graduation stage. Well, it's actually Danilo Solomensev. And he's just happy to be here. I would say it's a new chapter in, in my life, which I was following to for, for a long time. So it took a long, long academic break. Newly minted USF grad Danilo Solomensev has enough chapters to write a book. He left his home, Ukraine, in 2017 to study marketing at USF. When COVID hit, he went back home for two years, then came back to USF just weeks before Russia invaded. I would say it's anger, it's sadness, it's frustration, it's all, it's all at the, t the same time. He told his mother to pack a go bag. When war broke out, she fled to Slovakia. I'm so proud that uh, he finally um, done this, uh, this good job. She flew in this week to watch him graduate and leave Saturday morning. It's a nice break from the war and worry. Today they do loudly and of course uh, I want it, uh, the same for my son too. And she got it. <laughs> Even though he never fought in a battle, he persevered like so many other Ukrainians, but with his education. For me to give up, it, it, it would be just to skip all of that work and all of that, um, how would I put it, all of that work. Eh? And all of the time and money which, would put, which was put into myself. Salaman said will go to Slovakia in a few days to visit his mom and friends and continue his hard work no matter where he is. Now that he's graduated, Solomon Sev plans on pursuing a master's degree, of course, at USF. In Tampa, Trevor Sahaki, 8 on your side.